is Jordan, and today I'm going to be testing out different famous Instagram slimes! And I am so excited because I love slimes. I'm going to test out the different slimes and tell you if they're worth it or not. So let's get started. So for all of these slimes, I did purchase the biggest size that I could get. And unfortunately, these slimes are so popular that like everything was sold out and this was the largest size that I could get at the time. So we're going to start off with the biggest size that I got and it's an 8 ounce container and it is from Peachy Slime Bakery. This slime was for $12 and it is an 8 ounce slime. It's also supposed to be cloud like strawberry slime and I've never had like a cloud slime. So I'm really excited. So let's open it up and see. Ooh, Ooh what is this? I've never felt a cloud slime before and this feels weird. It has no scent. This is really, really weird. Okay, what? Ooh, it like leaves a sticky residue on your hand and like all the little um, flakies that are in it. Ooh. Ew, it dirty the table really bad though. <laughs> um, so overall this slime is really good. It stretches really nice and it looks super duper pretty. The only bad thing about it is that it leaves a sticky like mess all over your table and all over your hands. So yeah. And for $12, I feel like I could probably make it myself and not make it this messy. So maybe I'd probably vote in the middle because it's a good size. Like eight ounces, that's a pretty good size for $12. So I don't know, in the middle. So this next slime is from Slimy Cereal. It was $7.50 and it looks like it's in a four ounce container so I'm guessing that's four ounces. This one is Melted Candy Corn Slime. I'm super excited because if you don't already know, I love candy corn. So I hope it smells like candy corn. That would be awesome. Let's just open it up. Oh, look at that. Oh, there's like, oh man. Oh no, what if it's too sticky? This? feels like melted candy corn. What is this? <laughs> I think it's a butter slime. This like, whoa. Okay, this is really cool. All right, so this is the slime. It feels like butter slime, so I'm pretty sure they put clay into it. It is really cool though, like, it is super stretchy. It's like really nice butter slime. <gasps> it smells like candy corn! Oh. This is good. This slime is really cool. It smells like candy corn and it's a butter slime, which I love butter slimes. So this one, I would give a thumbs up. slime is by Snoop Slimes and it's either five or six ounces. I can't really tell. It didn't really say. Um, it's called Silly Floam and it's for $12.80 for this little container. So hopefully it's really good. And as you can tell, it kind of separated like the slime from the foam. So I'm excited to mix it together and see what it's like. Ooh, I'm so excited. Do you hear that crunch? Let's take it out. Already, already it has a very strong blueberry smell. Like, it smells so good though. That's cool. <laughs> I like how there's different like sized beads in here. It's not all just like teeny beads and it's not all just large beads. Wow, that smells so good. And it's really stretchy. 
This is probably the best flow that I've ever owned. Okay, I really love this. It does really remind me of like Sully, the character from Monsters Inc. Because it's got the blue slime with the white beads and purple beads in there, which is really cool. I'd say this one has been the most worth it out of all of them so far that we've done. It it feels really cool. Good job, Snoop Slimes. <laughs> detox water it is by snoop slimes again and it's a clear slime and it was for eleven dollars i'm assuming it's the same size as the other one the silly slime five or six ounces i can't really tell but it's got like these cool little um i don't know what you call them they're like fruit little slabs <laughs> um fruit little slices so i have never been able to make a really good clear slime so i'm excited to test out this clear slime oh, oh. ew ew you could like see that is so weird you can oh it's shrinking you could see my fingerprints this is exciting this is a really cool slime. It is crystal clear. Oh, this is, oh, it ripped. Don't you hate it when that happens? But this is really cool. It looks super cool. Like it's got these little, um, it's got these little fruit slices in it and it looks so cool. I love it. So in all my attempts to make a clear slime, I've always had the problem where it just rips and this one has the same problem. <laughs> I don't know if that's just how clear slime is because it's kind of more like plasticky or rubbery and so it just tends to rip like very easily and so I think that's just how clear slime is but I guess maybe I just like regular slime more than clear slime because I would rate this one a thumbs to the middle because it rips and I wish it didn't rip but you know I guess that's how clear slime is. Overall, it's a cool look though. I like having the little fruit in it. slime for six dollars it is by scented slime by Amy and it was wrapped in a ton of bubble wrap when it came and unfortunately it leaked a tiny bit but the bubble wrap helped it so it didn't get everywhere so that's a plus and I'm really excited to see what this one smells like and it's bamboo slime so I'm wondering if it would have a different texture let's open it up and see this one is a tiny little container of slime but literally that was all that was left on her site this tiny little container of slime that I could get. That's what it looks like. It looks like it has like chunkies on it. Ew! Okay, let's pull it out. Ew. It's like got crunchies in it. Like as if you took those clear beads and like blended them up. That's kind of what it feels like. Oh my! There's a panda! No way! That is so cute! Because it's a bamboo slime and it came with a little panda. Okay, that is cute. 
Ooh, I don't know if I like the smell. <laughs> um, it has like, um, I guess a vegetable smell. It's not a horrible smell, but it's not really a good one either, so I don't know. But can you see the texture in this, guys? This has the weirdest texture. Well, whatever they put in this little slime, it is a really cool texture. I don't know how they did it, but like it's got these cool little beadies in them or something. They're not really beads, they're super small, but like it's not like the snow stuff that was in the other one. It's really cool. So it has a really cool texture. Smell is not so great. The color is really pretty though. And this slime is bigger than what I expected. It's kind of like the size of the palm of your hand, which I thought it was going to be like super teeny because it's a three ounce slime, but it's kind of big and it stretches a ton. This slime is really cool. I would give it a thumbs up for the slime, for the scent, a thumbs down, but overall the slime gets a thumbs up. Next slime is by Artistic Slimes. It's I think it's a four ounce. It's called Enchanted Apple and it was for eight dollars. Ooh. Ooh, it's like clear, but it's dyed red. Ooh. That looks cool. It kind of has like a fresh apple. It's not like apple like in your face. It's like I just went outside to an apple orchard and it, I could smell the apples already. That's what I would describe this as. <laughs> okay, so, oh, it's so glossy. I don't wanna like, I, ooh, ooh, look at that. This is what it looks like. Oh my, this is really cool. Wow, it has like this purple like, glitter stuff in it that makes it look like um metallic that's what it is it's like a purple metallic glitter in it that makes it look really cool okay that's got a good click to it this slime is really good and it's super stretchy and it's a clear slime but it's just been dyed red so overall for this one this one gets a big thumbs up because this one is really good look at that because I wish there was more slime to play with but still it was really fun to play with all the slime this one is by raindrop slime it is a four ounce chameleon skin clear slime for $12 I got this much for $12 these were the same price okay well it's a clear slime so maybe this one will be really cool let's open it and find out it has zero smell Yeah. So I can see why it's called chameleon skin because if you can see there's like these little beads in them It's like little round beads that it's like all these different colors So I'm guessing that's why it's called chameleon skin. It's kind of cool Ooh. Oh, it rips Okay, I'm pretty sure all clear slime just rips but look at that. Oh Oh, no, it has a hole. Hello <laughs> This slime is pretty good. It rips once again, which is kind of sad. But what can you do? It's clear slime. It bounces! What? Okay. 
What in the world? I have never had a slime that bounces like this. So that's what it looks like. It has like these little beads in it. I really love this slime. The only bad thing about it is that it rips once again. So it's not my favorite slime because it rips. Sully slime because this one was really cool. I think if I activated it more, it'd be like, yup! And my least favorite would probably be this one right here because it gets all over the table, all over your hands. The little uh, material inside of it, I think it's fake snow, gets everywhere. So thank you all so much for watching. Comment down below what's your favorite type of slime. We'll see you all next time. 